When I was about 18, I started uploading time-lapse clips of myself to YouTube, just drawing celebrity portraits. I've always kind of been fascinated with portraiture and people's faces. So naturally kind of led on to celebrities, um, been heavily influenced by Andy Warhol. And then I saw a newspaper article about Simon Cowell, which said he either love him or you hate him. So I instantly thought about Marmite, did a portrait of him using Marmite on toast, which seemed like the most fitting canvas. That had an amazing reaction on YouTube. And eventually just sort of branched out into all these unusual materials, unusual ways of making art, like I've painted with my feet, I've painted with my tongue, painting on really odd surfaces, like today where I'm painting on the fridge. Obviously YouTube, you can kind of get in touch from all over the world you can you can watch videos anywhere so uh, the, the views started going up and up uh, press started to get interested um, I got to appear on a few TV shows including Britain's Got Talent in 2011 got to the semi-final obviously that kind of escalated the, the my sort of audience and ever since then it's been a full-time career um, got to work with several companies and brands around the world and celebrities themselves so it's going very, it's going very well Generally, the reaction is always kind of shocked. They don't tend to believe that it is what it is. Um, people tend to um, sort of think that everything creative has to be paint, oil, pastels. So I just kind of like to show, to think outside the box, and show to do things a little bit differently.